What's up guys, Mark here, back again for another edition of Event Horizon Models. Today we got uh, coolant on the workbench, it's the Hazagawa 172 scale, the classic Fock Wolf 190D9, the long nose Dora, one that I do not have in my collection. So uh, yeah, eagerly uh, anticipating getting this together so I can put it in the display case. I uh, love the D9, the uh, UMO powered Fock Wolf. Um, yeah, let's get started.
Okay, and so completes the Hazagawa 170 second scale Focke-Wulf 190 long nose Dora, the D9. Uh, very, very uh, enjoyable build. Uh, not with a few little hiccups along the way, but nothing crazy by any means. Um, the, uh, there's a couple of uh, detail notes that, uh, that aren't here. For one thing, the little aerial loop at the, or not the loop, but the, the aerial antenna at the bottom um, disappeared. So it's not on there. You can probably see the little hole um, in the reflection of the, uh, the turntable. But uh, that's not there. Uh, what else? Uh, oh, yeah, the framing on top. So the rear sliding canopy, uh, the framing at the very the little strip that goes from the very forward edge of the of the, the sliding canopy to midway um, is off. And I don't know what happened. I used a, an Edward mask, and I think I just put it on wrong. But um, anyway, so that's that's sort of an issue, which uh, obviously is not worth correcting at this point. Um, the uh, spinner and the propeller blades are pretty glossy still. I did put a couple of coats of clear flat on them, but um, yeah, they still uh, seem to be pretty a little on the shiny side. So what I might do is, uh, they, it, the propeller just comes right off. So what I'll do is before it goes into the display cabinet, I will um, put another coat on there. But um, other than that, um, glad to have another 70 second scale uh, aircraft uh, finished to go in the display cabinet and uh, like I said I'm very very pleased with this uh, it's a beautiful kit if you can find one uh, you won't be disappointed a little sparse on the detail in the uh, cockpit but um, you know if uh, you do come across one for cheap uh, build it it's uh, it's a really enjoyable build uh, and uh, yeah so anyways uh, I'll just uh, uh, continue with some more uh, turntable shots and uh, some some video on that and uh, yeah that concludes Hazagawa's long nose Dora thanks for watching